29 properties in a village south of Danville need some serious cleaning. This after the EPA finds test results with high levels of lead and arsenic in the land. In tonight's top story, News Channel 9's Heather Good explains where the contamination came from and if there's any hope for the site and residential properties nearby. 60 years after Hegler Zinc ceased operations just south of Danville, the EPA is asking residents what they think should be done about the contaminated soil at the site and residential areas nearby. I'm not planning on moving. They're just going to have to fix the issue. So The Environmental Protection Agency is reaching out to residents of the village of Hegler to find a remedy to soil contamination. A 100 acre site in the area was used as a zinc smelting facility some six decades ago. And according to the EPA, the site and residential soil nearby are contaminated with arsenic and lead as a result. They did come and do soil samples and dug holes in everybody's yards and mine was uh, fairly decent compared to some of them. There are 109 properties in the residential area near the site. Not every lot has been tested, but so far 27 properties show high levels of lead and four show high levels of arsenic, according to the EPA. One resident says he found what he believes to be slag, which develops through the burning process and contains lead and arsenic residue on his property. From the plant over there, I just found it in the garden tilling up the yard. Now the EPA is moving forward, sending more letters to residents about its findings. I received one about two weeks ago uh, informing me about they were going to do some more test samples. Um, I have to mail a consent letter back giving them permission to come in and test the soil. The EPA is holding a public meeting to discuss the clean up on Thursday, July 24th at 630 at David S. Palmer Arena in Danville. In Vermillion County, Heather Good, News Channel at 9 on Fox, Illinois.